Go Make Disciples 10 Actions That Facilitate Reproductive Disciple Making The objective of this video is to help you lay plans to model reproducible methods in every facet of making disciples. The expected outcome of your plans is that local disciples implement methods that reproduce new believers, disciples, cells, and leaders. We start with three definitions. Disciples, those who practice together loving obedience to Jesus' commandments. Disciple making, teaching others to obey together Jesus' commandments. Training, making disciples of those who make disciples of others. The following actions are based upon this principle. The making of loving, obedient disciples remains a basic, ceaseless requirement for birth, growth, and reproduction of Christian cells, churches, missions, and movements. Note. The following ten actions may occur simultaneously or in any order. Action 1. Model. Demonstrate every activity in ways that others can imitate immediately in their work with others. Keep every activity so simple and imitable that anyone can do the same with others. Rising very early in the morning, while it was still dark, he departed and went out to a desolate place, and there he prayed. And Simon, and those who were with him, searched for him, and they found him. Action 2. Obey. Teach all seekers and believers to obey Jesus' general commandments above all else. Require of others to do nothing more than what Jesus has commanded. Go therefore and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, teaching them to observe all that I have commanded you. And behold, I am with you always, to the end of the age. Action 3 Gather. Gather seekers and disciples only to praise Jesus and to obey together his commands. Keep all gatherings interactive so that each one's spiritual gifts may manifest. They devoted themselves to the apostles' teaching and the fellowship, to the breaking of bread and the prayers, and awe came upon every soul and many wonders and signs were being done through the Apostles. Action 4. Teach. Teach truth first from Bible stories that learners will be able to share with others in turn. Teach through dialogue so that we learn needs and everyone learns from each other. As were the days of Noah, so will be the coming of the Son of Man. For as in those days before the flood, they were eating and drinking, marrying and giving in marriage, until the day when Noah entered the ark, and they were unaware, until the flood came and swept them all away. Action 5. Coach. Empower the willing to make disciples of others in ways that we have modeled. Coach willing workers who prove able to coach others to do the same in turn. Jesus called the twelve and began to send them out two by two, and gave them authority over the unclean spirits. He charged them to take nothing for their journey, except a staff. The apostles returned to Jesus, and told him all that they had done and taught. Action 6. Love. Maintain interpersonal relations with disciples who do the same with others. 
make disciples mainly in small groups that practice together all that they learn together. To Timothy, my beloved child. I thank God whom I serve, as did my ancestors, with a clear conscience, as I remember you constantly in my prayers night and day. As I remember your tears, I long to see you, that I may be filled with joy. Action 7. Evangelize. Let the good news flow mainly through existing families and friendships. Let everyone tell the good news to others in ways that fit their culture and personality. It is written that the Christ should suffer, and on the third day rise from the dead, and that repentance and forgiveness of sins should be proclaimed in his name, to all nations, beginning from Jerusalem. You are witnesses of these things. Action 8. Report. Have every disciple report on how he obeyed Jesus in the past week and on what happened. Have every disciple tell how he will obey Jesus this week and will help others to do the same. The gospel is bearing fruit and increasing. Since the day you heard it and understood the grace of God in truth, just as you learned it from Epaphras our beloved fellow servant. He is a faithful minister of Christ on your behalf, and has made known to us your love in the Spirit. Action 9. Track. Allow every disciple to start making disciples of others as soon as God allows. Keep track of disciples' disciples to their third generation, coaching them in how to coach others. Now in these days, when the disciples were increasing in number, the word of God continued to increase, and the number of the disciples multiplied greatly in Jerusalem, and a great many of the priests became obedient to the faith. Action 10. Reproduce. Let new discipleship cells spring up anywhere before holding big meetings. Appoint as cell leaders only those individuals who have made disciples of others. When they had preached the gospel to that city, and had made many disciples, they returned, strengthening the souls of the disciples, encouraging them to continue in the faith, and saying that through many tribulations, we must enter the kingdom of God. And, they, appointed elders for them in every church, 